Hey, what's going on guys? Derek here. Happy Monday. Hopefully you have started your week off well. And wanted to uh, wanted to talk about one of the coaches that I follow <clears throat> was talking this past week about having an athlete mindset. And me being working hourly, uh, middle-aged, having a family, me in that athlete mindset mindset is something that I don't see myself as. I don't see myself as a athlete in <clears throat> like professional sports, having that focus, having that 100% commitment to your nutrition, uh, your exercise, and your sleep. Those three things are something that I can tell you that I'm not 100% focused on or are not one of my top priorities. Um, like nutrition example is having that impulse to grab my kids leftovers, you know, stuff that's fast food. That's not good for me or going to Sonic uh going to McDonald's, those kind of things, those impulse buys and me giving into those. That's that's big. That's big for me. And honestly, I think it's what that self confidence that I've been talking about, where it lacks or where I go to in the past is my past failures and my past failures in controlling my impulses and those moments of struggle. So wanted to get with you athlete mind mindset. That's, that's a new term for me. I like it. I don't see myself an athlete. I got to get my mind around that and wanting to improve myself in so many areas. I do need that athlete mindset and the fact that I'm the only one, you're the only one that can take care of yourself. And that needs to be a priority. You can't, you can't be a man or woman who is excelling, who is progressing, who is reaching their goals without making priorities and structure in those three areas. And I think our families deserve it. Our work, coworkers, employees deserve that. And that's something I need to, I need to realize. So really good message that I heard and want to wish y'all a good week. And I will talk to y'all tomorrow. Peace guys. Have a good one.